Okay guys, I've got uh, my new incubator set up here. Um, it, this is the same uh, wardrobe that I used for my incubator last year. However, I guess the temps were swinging in a little too much and the door didn't have a very good seal. Um, so that's why I was having bad luck with the eggs last year. Um, hopefully this year will be different. Um, I've built a brand new door here and it's got uh, the doors um, clear ac acrylic and uh, there's two layers of it one on the inside one on the outside to uh, um, you know have a, a barrier uh, you know of, of air in between them um, it's insulated with two inch styrofoam there's a gap between the back wall of the wardrobe and then the styrofoam itself that's where my flex wad is behind this uh, back wall here um, there's a, a two by two spacers back there so there's about an inch and a half of, of room um, I've got a fan up there and a fan down there I've also got some water bottles in there for you know to keep the temps more stable when I open the door um, so the fan on the bottom blows air up into the incubator and the fan in the top sucks air and it takes it back and it just passes it by the flex watt and it keeps the air circulated and heated evenly, uh, hopefully. And, um, it, uh, you know, just a constant cycle of air going round and round. And, uh, I've only had it running about... 18 hours or so and uh, so far so good um, you can see I've got my helix probe just uh, hanging there in the middle I've got three three shelves um, I can you can see in the seams there I've got it uh, uh, filled with uh, expanding foam so it's nice and tight seal all around in there um, I've got a fluorescent light in there so I can see everything that's going on in there without opening the door uh, Helix is up here set at 89. Uh, you can see that thermometer says uh, 88 and a half. Um, and then I've got six boxes down there. They've each got a thermometer in them. They're all pretty pretty similar in temps. Um, I've got. Uh, you can see I've got the doors uh, latched here. This isn't for theft at all or anything like that of course not you could just unscrew the screws right off the door but um, this is just you know so I, I make sure it's locked and then you see when I open it here I've got an alarm that goes off at the bottom there which uh, again it's not for theft purposes at all it's just um, in case the door was left open or popped open somehow I, I would uh, I would be able to tell so I'll just shut that off quickly and show you guys. So on the inside of the door here, I've got this foam uh, weather stripping all the way around, and then as well, I've got it all the way around on the inside here. Um, shelves are nice and sturdy and screwed in there, right to the wood. Um, that's uh, that's pretty much it. Um, it seems to be holding temps nice and stable uh, from top to bottom. Um, and I'm really pleased with the way everything turned out. So I'm really glad that I'll be able to see my eggs and my temps without opening the door. And uh, I'm really, really excited to, to get some eggs going in this. That's all for now.